We got a team of Sone and Ralphie, which is like, the I really want to win doubles team. <laughs> Facing off against Light and Don, which is the team that, honestly, I would pick to win doubles out of them all. They've always been a super solid team. They're nearly yeah. static partners whenever yeah. they're in the same room. Since Smash 4, they've been like that. And now they're trying to get to Ultimate. I think they're still be pretty good uh, doubles teaming together. Um, I'm not sure how they're going to team up against... Whoa, that goes an early stock by Light. <laughs> Man, that's really important. And the, just keeping Light off the field, not even just taking his stocks, but just keeping him away from the action. Because you know if he starts getting a combo going, that's it. Someone's bleeding after that. Right. And Don's there to try to save Light there, but he does the best that he can, but as well, like, not really can do much, though. Now, Ray, we're seeing Mario on the screen, which has been Don's main since Smash 4, but how do you feel about Mario in this game? Because we haven't been seeing a lot of them lately. We haven't, but I think like, uh, Mario is, still does good in this game, as he almost as he does in Smash 4. Uh, maybe better, maybe no, definitely not worse. Uh, like I think the uh, his new combo game is really weird, but in doubles, uh, Mario is just like the way he was in Smash 4. I think. Okay, probably better. Whoa! Yeah, at the very least, we know that Don and Light's combos are still the same from Smash 4. At least the way they can end out stocks. Yeah, their combos, their combo game is superbly amazing. It's like they know what to follow up afterwards, and it's crazy. Oh, jeez. Okay, uh, so I'm able to make it back. And I guess the us kill still on zone. Right, yeah, like, like over the Hail Mary Smash attacks, I feel it's going to be like a big X factor to this whole Whoa. set, just because like, all of these players have such a good concept of what to do. Whoa, whoa, we so, whoa. You saw that yeah, particle yeah, yeah. effect, too, yeah, right? Yeah, I saw that, too. <laughs> nice! <laughs> Don does not care about big swords. <laughs> Song keeps swinging. It doesn't matter to green team. There is no hitbox, too. It just stays there as a visual effect. That's gross. <laughs> all right, lights off stage. Makes it back at air dodging. Oh, no. Miss input on Ralphie. A tragedy in Act 1. No! Oh, a tragedy so in Act 2. Oh, uh, that's right. so shams. Um, this is a grim game one for uh, Red Team, but they've managed to play it well. At least you can see what their game plan is in being like, focus out light, make sure that Don isn't there to protect light, separate it out. But then you have to deal uh, with the fact that Don and Light fight the 2v1 really well. Yeah, they really do. And it's amazing. They do so phenomenally well like that. Uh, I think... Uh, this team can work out, I think, for both Ralphie and Zone. I just think like they probably got two ham like I don't know. They got their early suck on light, but then suddenly whatever happened and they just turned that around significantly. Like I don't know what it was. But I think Ralphie probably gonna stick with Politina, yeah. Yeah, out of the other characters that Ralphie's been playing lately, those being like Pichu and Cloud and Trainer. I, I can't see those bringing anything to the table that Palutena wouldn't be able to accomplish. And at the very least, I feel like Palutena is able to slow a little bit of the momentum down, whereas the rest of those characters are just chips all in on aggro play. Um, if not, if this game doesn't go out well for Rafi and Zone, probably Rafi would go to Cloud. Yeah, Cloud. Cloud would be interesting to see just because it would be like the return of Double Swords, yeah. something that we've grown accustomed to seeing from Smash 4. And I feel like we haven't seen enough Cloud lately, which is really weird to say. <laughs> what do you mean? Your region has two, I think. Uh, it's, uh, that's two that I would expect us to have. That's two too many. Honestly, <laughs> yeah. Honestly, yeah, but like... <laughs> oh, oh, man, I feel like... Wait. Oh, no. oh, wait. He parried that, and he tried to do down smash from it, and he still couldn't get the punish over there. Don's stock is gone. Lies off stage. Uh... Ooh, nice air dot mix up there. I like that. We haven't seen uh, that too often as an option from a lot of players, but Light does a good job here. of spicing up how he returns to stage. All right, this is a uh, this now this is a better favorite for the red team here. Um, green, can, green can make it back. Wait, that was a gross that, angle. Up smash sending so way out that from the was action. Super weak too. Oh, and, and Don catching that, uh, the lap and the down, uh, up B with down smash. Don managing to clean up the stock, but look at the stock counts that's on. That's so losing his first stock. Ralphie's still chilling with his. Yeah, but Light is slowly racking up this percent, uh, on zone. As he does, keeping zone off stage, not letting him play the game. And there's the up smash kill from, uh, Don. 
And one thing to take into consideration is not only is Politano a popular character, but I guess solid representation in New England. Light's definitely going to have a good concept of how to combo the character, how to box around his sword. Well, this is clean. I'm popular to take it. There's only so much you can do, though, when you're vulnerable like that. And then you're light, too. And I would take it. Okay. Uh, this is so kind of... Yeah, this is so even for both this uh, team. It's been a very bombastic fight, but it hasn't really swung in either player's direction. Rafi and Sona's done a really good job of being able to keep green team from like steamrolling them. And even though they don't have an assured lead, if they keep up this momentum, we could very well see us going into a game three. Yeah, I think so too. Uh, no, he was trying to give him again with using the air. Uh, didn't follow with that. Uh, couldn't get the air for kill. Uh, uh, just about anything Dunk die off right now. Yeah, one thing you got to appreciate is even throughout this character crisis that Ralphie has been dealing with, he still has, like, such a good mindset for how to approach the game. I feel especially so in doubles. You can take notice of, like, where he's moving to position himself either to protect Sone or to build off of Sone's stray hits. Or in general, Ooh. just trying to keep himself paced around the action. Oh, alright, now it's up to... Now it's up to Ralphie doing a uh, 3v1 situation here. Now, do you think Politana can handle the 2v1? I'm pretty but sure she can, yeah. But uh, it's just, when you, when this happens, there's something she can really do about it, unfortunately. That, oh, attackable. This is really good for Ralphie now. Uh, that was another odd angle. It's not often that we see Nair just fire right upwards. Uh, we. It, it's possible that they could still do that. It's that a lot of players prefer just using their send towards to the blast zone. But uh, if the opponent is like a really high percent that is unable to, you, know, you cannot be able to attack, they'd rather just do it towards the stage instead. Makes sense. Yeah, so it's like you automatically die here when, uh, because the game says so. It's literally that. Nice parry from Ralphie. Dash attacks in. Um, Super close now. Don seems to have a really good idea of how he can move in with Mario, and he's constantly setting up for these juggles. That could be it. Yeah, yeah wow. It's gonna be all right. Oh, I can't wait that there would take it. It's really strong, that move now. Like, it was already a really good part of Mario's kit, both for his combo game and for securing stocks in Smash 4, but now it seems, like, especially so. Yeah, it's... I think they made this... Just slightly stronger than it was to Smash 4. Like, I don't remember that killing so early. That's usually like a move you'll see kill like at probably at 130. Alright, uh, looks like he's still keeping with the uh, the Palu here. Yep, and the classic Mario. Ralphie managed the 2v1 the, uh, the really well and was really close to capping it off on Don. But either way, I feel like the momentum of these matches, it's like it's swinging so even handedly that like Ralphie and Stone still have the opportunity to take this back, especially with a pretty strong start right out the gate here in game three. Yeah, this is, well, this is a good string of combos for the blue, for the red team right now. They, that's, <laughs> they're getting ping pong everywhere for the green team. Uh. Uh, so far, not, not, not the green team is making their own uh, uh, come on their own. Yeah, that's just sort of the nature of fighting when you have like an aggressive team like like Light and Don fighting off against like a very confident team like Ralphie and so like they know what they can get away with and they're gonna try to stretch that as far as possible. Whoa, that also almost killing them. Uh, the fair from so own would kill Don off stage, but and nice stare by the Ralphie taking Light stock. This is this now. This is really good for the red team here, getting an early uh, lead here. Now they're just gonna try and stretch the lead as best as they can. Even if they don't manage to take more stock, just building up that damage, asserting that stage control, super important. Just for just limiting the options that Light and Don can go for. Yeah, this is so. This, this is still uh, really good for red team. As long as they, uh, uh, that's fine though. Getting percent and for anything is really good. What the heck? <laughs> Uh, Any explosive flame always looks wild. Yeah, and nice punish from Light. Risky uh, dash attack. It's still connected, but that's a lot of light that Light can use to punish that. And the us trap confirmed from the from the toss from Zone. Not a dare with. Oh, it's yeah. That was, uh, that didn't so good for Light. Oh, that, where? That how? Where did he go? He just went gone. All right, word. 
<laughs> I was just about to say if something oh, about Oh no. Okay. So Don was gonna flood uh, Ike, but Light said, I'm gonna shine instead, and that shine reflected the water. <laughs> well, <laughs> that's hilarious. I don't know, so far this is still pretty good for the red team. I think Creed team can still probably make this back somehow. Yeah, they're not out of it just yet, but Don's hurting. He's sitting at 90%, and while Soen's on the hunt for that stock, finding themselves in the 2v1 situation is going to be super deadly for green team. Oh, Light was trying to catch that landing, but that fair said no. And that Don's trying to do it. All right, uh, back throw. Now, it's so hard to get a combo off from Palu's back throw because it's so fast. It's hard to react to that. It's fast and it sends at a fairly high angle, so like you have to commit to whatever your option is coming into it. Exactly. That back here would do it, yeah. <laughs> Fresh off the sock. Uh, all moves refreshed. Back here, we're just going to fill the middle stage. Red right. team putting a point on the board, and then... Now it's time to see what Light and Don do when they're on the uh, the back end of things. Do you think we're going to see a different stage or PS2 the whole way through? We're probably going to see Battlefield or maybe Yoshi's uh, story. Or uh, Kyle is oh, okay. All right. Interesting. It's going to give a little bit more space to play around with. So I can understand why they would want it. At the very least, it's going to be a little bit more difficult for Sone and Ralphie to cover each other just because they have a little bit more ground to traverse. Yeah. Um, there's also going to be more space here, too. No platforms are coming to play as well. Um, I'm looking forward to see how this is going to turn out for this game. It's going to be an odd one, especially, too, because I know Sone prefers this stage. And how do you feel about the stage for Paulo Tano? Um... Well, now that this platform is at the side, most Palutena's would probably just like uh, grab the ledge and then jump and then air dodge to the platform as a mix up to come back to the, to the stage. All right, so she still has options as far as returning to the stage goes. Yeah. Do you think that she's going to offer anything for covering the ledge? Because we know for a fact that Mario and Fox can take Pro good advantage of having a platform. Um, probably not. In fact, this is probably going to benefit Light more because now he gets to side B and land either on the platform or on the ledge. Okay, makes sense. Yeah. So far, Green Team's been putting a lot of hurt onto the green, uh, onto the red team. And the Osmash awesome didn't get the kill yet. Uh, oh, that back air almost killing. Oh, light. Oh, uh, that's Dawn. Dawn uh, didn't recover. It was way too low for that recovery. It looked like because Ralphie intercepted with himself that the uh, the up wasn't able to reach in time. What the heck? All right, now we all know Don is going to look for that L-Smash. <laughs> that's going to come to bite him, really, because if that's all if that's all Don's looking for, then the red team is going to know that for sure, and it's, it's going to wait on Don for him to do the L-Smash. Yeah, on the whole, green team seems to be struggling for the kill here. It's a bit unfortunate, given as this was their counterpick stage. Like, they had the opportunity to make the most oh, of it. Yeah, that would do it, though. Like, eventually, the, the kill will come to you at some point. And just like that, when I did that uh, uh, combo one to three, uh, Light saw that coming and just did an L smash for the kill there. Ooh, and Light's dragging up a whole lot of percent on his own here. Yeah, those up our chains. Ooh, man. They are, and it's so crazy. Nice forward tilt, still alive. The, uh, someone's trying to cover the, the roll in there. Now yeah. someone's off stage. Everybody talking about how good Ike is still has to remember that it, he, when he's leaving himself open with his more laggy options, like he's super susceptible to finding himself a victim of combos or being misplaced on the stage. Up till being one of those moves. It's a really good option for the sake of reading because it's so wide, but like Ike's sitting there forever, and if he whips, it's go time. Yeah, that's literally it. You see that opening from Ike, and then you, just, you have to go for it. That L smash will take it. But Rafi's still has setting his socks so well. He set, he has two socks with him while Zone only has one. And, so, and wow, why is already him a whole lot of percent? Zone just can't get can't get pressure. Like he wants to get off. <laughs> he can't breathe at all yes. in this. Uh gets attacking, makes it back. Oh, I missed a confirm on that. Yeah, they're not giving Zone any any chance to breathe at all. Taking is, full advantage of juggling him too. He's just at the mercy. And Ralphie's not really in a position to do much about it. He's either trying to rack up damage in his own right on green team players, 
Or trying to get out of the combos themselves. Yeah, so that would do it. Now it's a 2v1 situation here. And this is fairly similar to what we saw earlier on, but... Down smash? Well, that well. would do it? All right. Another 2v1 situation, uh, 1v1 situation here. Um, I think this is the last time it's what happened in game one or game yeah, two. Yeah, Don Maddox 2 ended out with a down air in game two. And that was on Pokemon Stadium, but it's looking like a lot better of a situation for Ralphie now, especially since he's got oh, body advantage. Oh, yeah, that's the classic. <laughs> Get the landing back air, and then another back air immediately is short hop 1 2. And with that, we're going into the game five. Game five situation here. <laughs> Now, do you see us going back to Kalos, considering how th the stage really seemed to have uh, worked well for Son and Ralphie? Yeah, it worked out well, but um, I don't. Mm, this is really hard for me. To, it's really hard to like like they started to adapt so well in the beginning. Oh yeah, unless they're changing. Oh, they're going to Unova instead. Ooh, ooh, this is interesting. Okay, Unova. I think it's so, it's also small as well. So, they're gonna. <laughs> everyone's gonna get hit. Like, they're not probably not gonna have a chance to breathe at all whatsoever here. Like, not even. Uh, probably. Maybe Ralphie or. Ralphie's gonna get hit a lot here. Alright, maybe that's the game plan because we know the green team is able to operate really well out of scuffles. Like, when all the fighting's breaking loose in one small area, like Mario and Fox are the kind of characters who are gonna come out the better end of it. Follow up there. I don't know what was on looking for there. It looked like he was trying to get some sort of follow up, but he didn't want to interrupt Ralphie's nap. Yeah. Really good cognizance on this part because it's like he knows that if Ralphie's got a game plan going, he can't oh, interrupt too heavily. This is really bad. He has no jump to it. He can't make it back, and that's it. That's really unfortunate. And therein lies the issue with this stage. If you're not able to keep in mind of like the space your teammates controlling, you're going to find yourself in a position where you're just going to get hit around. Yeah, I think that's what's going to happen here. Yeah, that's fine. That's really good. Because someone's at a low, low percent anyway. He could take that. He could take that hit. Yeah, plus it's I Like, he's li he's living to decent percentages anyways. Yep. All right, nice team follow-up from Dawn. The parry and the Porta would do it, yeah. All right, this is one way to get your teammate yeah. back to the stage. Oh, <laughs> but not on this stage. That's why I don't like the stage. And that would do it. Yeah. Wow, this is really good for the green team. That blood really helped out there. Yeah, I don't know if it was Don or Light that recommended going to Unova instead of Kalos, but it was a really strong pick because this is quite the start to the match. We're only about a minute and a half in. They're two and a half minutes in. And look what's going on here. Like. Red team has so much to fight off against. It doesn't show it in the stocks, really, but this stage is under complete green team control. Yeah, it's just a complete turnaround for them, which is really good. Oh, that would do it. Okay, well, they're still breathing at some point, but uh, it's probably too late at this point. Oh, yeah, red team definitely needs some sort of a lucky break. Mm -hmm. Like, Crawfee's going to have to hold on to that stock for dear life. Yeah. I... Like, whether or not it's used as a reserve That's for... Own or himself. If they can probably get that early kill on Dawn, I guess, but I don't know. No, you don't want to no. do that. Oh boy. Alright, now we find ourselves in a 2v1 situation very different from earlier, because now Light's sitting with reserve stock. Even if Ralphie does manage to end it out. And he nearly does with the back air, but good DI keeps Light in it. Like he still has another stock to sit on, so. Ralphie's gonna have to bring this match to a screeching crawl, or it's curtains for a team. The thing is that, oh well, there's another down smash here. The thing is that there's nothing like, much they could. Oh, he has, no, he didn't okay, get hit. Okay, he jumped. Yeah. Okay, everyone's okay. <laughs> that was almost the lucky break that we were talking about. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Nair's catching both of these players. It's crazy. Yeah, Nair's kind of big. Nair's big. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> he waited so long for it. He just sat there I'm and like, took oh, it. wait a minute. I could kill with it. I could kill with this. <laughs> yeah, as far as confirming stocks, the forward smash is that new hotness from Mario. And it took Don a little bit to remember, but he got it down. Mm -hmm. And now they're going to be chilling Winterside Grand Finals.
All right, that, that was a three-two. Um, 